Hi, YouTube. I want to tell you what ce celebrities aren't telling us. You know, celebrities, they're always telling everybody about, you know, how to um, get fit, how to lose weight, how they exercise, what they eat. And you think they're telling you everything, right? Well, it's one thing celebrities aren't telling us. And what that is, is pain management. And I'm here to tell you. Those celebrities that's 40, 50, 60, 70 years old, they are doing some type of pain management to do all of that exercising and staying fit like they do. And well, I just recently found out that, um, and I'm, I'm upset about it actually because my back has been hurting almost all my life and it hasn't gotten any better over time. And I just found out that people are taking um cpd oil and i have some right here cpd oil i just bought some this little bottle here this is 1.5 millimeters and um 100 milligram and i paid 15 dollars for it and um i got some for my son too, well, my son and I, we're sharing this right now because we, we never used it before and I didn't want to waste money on something that didn't work. And my son, I bought it for um, his sake. It's, he's the reason why I thought about it in the first place because um, a, my fr a friend of mine, she told me that it helps as a anti-seizure medication. So, um, while we're waiting on our appointment with the, a neurologist, is, he he ha doesn't have seizures all the time, but nobody wants to have seizures anytime. So we're waiting on an appointment with a neurologist. And um, I don't know if I'm going to do the medication thing yet. Um, so, But we're trying this. And so I don't know about if it actually works for seizures because, like I say, my son, he only has seizures like once a year, something like that, sometimes once every six months or so. But um, it does help my back, and I'm just upset that I nobody told me about it before. You know, I've just been um, dealing with the back pain. I'm, I'm, I don't really like medication. I tried, you know, if there's any kind of way I can avoid medication, I will. But um, it tickled me because... Um, I, I finally broke down and asked my doctor for some medication for my back pain because I'm just tired. You know, I was getting to the point where I didn't want to move. You know, exercising was like out of the question because my back is hurting. And so um, after I finished cooking and cleaning and, and do things around the house, um, halfway through the day, my back is, is, is hurting pretty bad. So I finally got tired of it and I, I asked my doctor, um, for some medication, and I didn't ask for anything specific. I just wanted something that's going to um, give me some relief um, from my back pain. And he turned me down, and it really tickled me because all my life, um, when I go to the doctor, if, if I I don't even have to ask for medication. I never even had to ask for medication. I went to the dentist one time, and they gave me some, um, I believe it was Vicodin, but I was so high that I had to call the doctor, the dentist's office, and, and tell them that I, I needed something else because I couldn't function and take care of my son, you know, with the medication they gave me. So um, I've had doctors, you know, just write prescriptions um, whether you want them or not. You know, you didn't even have to ask for them. And so finally, you know, after all these years, I, I decided to, you know, go ahead and ask for um, something to, for relief from, from my back pain. And um, the doctor turned me down. So, um, but he did say, he said it would be more harm than good. But I don't know. I thought, you know, we had so much to choose from because I didn't ask for anything in Pacific. But this here, the CPD oil, um, yeah, because, I mean, you can get the really expensive kind. Of, this is just 100 milligrams. I paid fifteen dollars for it. It's um the size of the bottle is one point five millimeter, and um I have noticed that it is really really helping my back pain. 
and I, I did a little research on it. I actually did the research after I purchased it, purchased, purchased this thing here. And um, this right here, this brand is Rethink that I have here. But they, um, you know, like this is 100 um, milligrams. You can get, I think, I wanted to find out if it worked first. Because you can get 300 milligrams, 600 milligrams, 1,000 milligrams. And, um, but they cost a lot more than this. And um, I don't know what size they come in, but I found this at the grocery store and um, for $15. And I'm, I'm very happy with it. I'm very confident that, um, you know, that it works because I tried it. And believe me, if my back was still hurting, I would know it. And um, so I'm very happy. I'm just upset because it took me so long to find out about it. But to my understanding, it hasn't been on the market that long. And there's still a lot of debate about it and everything. But this brand here is Rethink that I have. And you just take a little bit. And, it, you know, and I didn't even have any instructions on what the doses is. I just um, give my son and myself like half a no. see, I don't want to spill any yeah like half a uh, dropper fill mm -hmm. like that and it tastes it you know it doesn't taste very good it almost doesn't have a taste to it you know it's kind of like when you um, drop it on your tongue or you know try to drop it as far back as you can so you don't have to taste it too much but it kind of um just tastes like slimy you know it, it it almost doesn't have a taste to it but it it is it, it puts me in the mind of castor oil but not as bad as castor oil no it's, it's nowhere near as bad as castor oil but it, it 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 doesn't have no i don't smell anything but you know it just feels funny on your tongue but yeah this is rethink cbd oil and um as far as back pain goes i i, I definitely recommend it I definitely recommend it, especially if you're trying to go natural. Um, you know, it's supposed to be from the hemp plant, you know, cousin to the marijuana plant. Um, it, to my knowledge, you don't get high or anything. You know, you don't feel any type of a highness. I mean, you might feel a little bit, um, maybe a little bit sleepy, you know, like maybe a, just a, a tad bit of a, drowsiness but um but definitely not no type of intoxication or anything like that and it helps to live and alleviate the pain and that's the main thing okay 